Hey guys, so in the state of California, we're supposed to run a front plate. Um, this one is mine, and this is my car. You see how much better it looks without a front plate? Well, problem is, I don't really mind that I have to run a front plate to drive around, but I do mind when I have to take photos or want to take photos of my car and there's a front plate. So, I'm about to show you guys the best front license plate mount. So this is the back of my license plate. And so you can see here and here, I have neodymium magnets. I don't know if I said that correctly. And another set of neodymium magnets. So the point of this is that you could just easily pull it off and pull it, put it back on whenever you want. Um, I've been commuting my car probably 500 miles a week and so far they've been good. They're only off the car right now because I'm, I decided to paint them before I just had a black sticker covering it. So with that said, I'll go ahead and install it and then show you guys how it works. With it on the car, this is how it looks. Um, you have the option of painting it or just leaving it how it is. Um, I'm about to go paint these black, but as you can see here, um, it's mounted on plastic and you could take off this grill portion and actually and put like a lock nut in the back. But on this, I'm just using self-tapping screws. So you don't want to over tighten it or else it's just gonna keep spinning and then you get loose and come off. You need to be able to do this is a countersunk screw and of course the magnets and then countersunk screw again with a bolt for the top portion. Um, you could pick up the magnets with a spacer so that way you could flip them around because with, cause without, uh, without the spacer, um, you won't be able to flip them around and they'll just like instead of attracting to each other they'll go the opposite way and push away so um, what I did since I'm a little bit cheaper I didn't get the spacer I just drilled onto the magnets so they'll be a little bit countersunk but that's like completely up to you on how you want to install it so here's my license plate um, let's go ahead and try it on so all you do it's literally ready. Are you ready? All right, and that's it. If you pull on it straight ahead, it's very like like it's very hard to take off. So in order to take it off, you have to pull up and try to slide it off the magnet itself, and then and then it'll come off easier. Feel free to ask any questions if you have any. Uh, I think it's a cool mod, uh, simple to do, and it helps like get away from tickets if you're ever traveling far. And with that said, peace out.